Hi everyone, it's Faye Bay. Welcome to another episode of Vigil Sisters. Today we're going to continue our map completion of Malcor's Leap. If this is your first time here, then remember to subscribe and ring the bell to keep up to date with all of our exploits across Tyria. I'll put a link in the upper right hand corner of the video for Monica's channel so you can check her out. And don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell over on her channel so you never miss an episode of our delightful little series. All of our social media links will be in the description box below as well so you can check those out after the video. Alright. So, so actually, uh, could you imagine, like, somebody joining, uh, like, starting to watch the episode, and the very first thing they're introduced, they're, the way they, the way I introduce myself to them is, yeah, hi. <laughs> could you? <laughs> I mean, it'll, it would leave a lasting impression. Shake <laughs> it off. Oh, God, there's so many things. Running so away. Running away. Running All away. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> oh, oh my god. god. Oh I want that tree, but I don't want it that badly. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm actually starting I'm actually having to save my elder actually no, actually I I sent a shit ton of, I just really remembered I sent a shit ton of Elderwood logs to uh my boyfriend's start starting to uh, stock up on or Celestial or Calcum imbued inscriptions for the guild. Mm -hmm. That's one of the things that I'm... Uh, we're talking about this off-camera, I think. Uh, I'm basically trying to fill up the guild hall. Everything in the guild hall that we can fill up, I want to fill up. Because we only upgrade it on streams, and we only stream together twice a month. Justice. Twice a week, sorry. Mm -hmm. So, like, it's a really... It's really, like, if you have the gold, it's really easy to fill up the guild hall. Mm-hmm. Um, so that we can, like, upgrade a shit ton of stuff every stream kind of thing. But, um, so that's one of my, like, one of my goals is to fill up the guild hall. And actually, I, I sent, he's, he's starting to help, too, with making Orichalcum, Celestial Orichalcum inscriptions. Mm -hmm. uh, and, like, he, I sent him, like, uh, like, a stack of, like, 50 ancient wood logs. Because he said he had plenty of Orichalcum. Just not enough ancient wood. So, mm -hmm. I was leveling my crafting, and I got to the point where, um... I got to the point where I didn't need, where I maxed it out, so I didn't need the extra ancient wood that I had left over. So I sent him all the extra ancient wood. And it was like 50, 50 fucking planks at that point that I had left over. Oh, wow. Because I, I bought, like, two stacks of logs is the thing. Like, I bought a stack of logs, wasn't enough, but another stack of logs was too much. <laughs> <laughs> There's no in-between. Yeah. I could have, like, done the math, to be honest. Like, I don't yeah. know, I know how to calculate it out, you know? So I could have done the math, or I could just spend a shit ton of gold and give the ex excess to my boyfriend. I don't know. But, like, I had, a. Uh... I will be leveling. This character is actually ga Games Love and Life is actually gonna be a uh, um, a um. She's actually going to be um a. What's it called? A, a huntsman and an armor smith as well. So I will be needing ancient wood again eventually. Mm -hmm. So I want to max out huntsman as well. That's one thing. Like one of my end game goals. Not anything that I'm gonna Shake work on anytime soon. But one of my my goals for like uh very end game is to have every discoverable recipe in the game mm -hmm. so i'm sure there are some recipes that are no longer able to be gotten because of like season one shit mm -hmm. you know but um like having the first step is to get every recipe that you can buy though mm -hmm. for me that's the first step rather than every uh the like the first actually more like the first step is leveling crafting through discovery mostly rather than uh crafting like a bunch of shit uh, uh of the same thing to level up my thing is gonna be i'm gonna mostly uh craft i'm gonna craft the materials to make it to get levels and then i'm gonna discover for the rest of the levels like once the materials that it requires to craft are no longer like give me stuff i'm gonna use that those materials to discover things but yeah um Shake it off. the main way i'm gonna get levels is through discovery mm-hmm 
And then, um... And then the second step is to buy all re all the recipes that are that are able to be bought with like various everything. So mm -hmm. one thing I'm gonna have to do I'm gonna have to do a few farming streams in Dry Top, most likely mm -hmm. because I hate in I hate Dry Top. So I'll probably end up doing like a few streams just to make it le less unbearable. Mm -hmm. I'm actually doing like a lot of farming streams recently, um, to make it. To make farming gold a little bit more bearable. Mm -hmm. But um, like one of the things I will the one one of the things I will be doing uh, for um, what, like I'll have to I'll end up doing a few farming streams in Dry Top. Uh, to get the recipes from Dry Top, I'll do Silver Waste runs. Actually, I think I have a, I have all recipes that can be bought in Silver Waste at this point. But, like, I will have to spend a lot of time in Dry Top, probably. Because, um... Because, like, I need a lot of the recipes, and I need a lot of the... And, like, there are recipes that are only discoverable with, um... With, um... What are they called? What are they called? Uh, the... They're, like, certain, like, skins that are gotten with the, uh... uh fossilized things oh um yeah yeah so i need to i have one fossilized one fossil basically so far and i haven't traded it in for anything because i don't know, like the whole fossilized thing mm -hmm. but like i'll probably end up like doing like a farming like a fi several here? farming streams to get every recipe in dry top and then get all the skins that i can in dry top but yeah so that'll be, like, a future thing. But actually, the month of October, to be honest, the month of October uh, is going to be almost completely dedicated to farming streams. Like, I've spent- I did a- I did a long- I, I spent a lot of time doing, um, achievement hunting streams for ver uh, but now I'm kinda needing gold for a lot of the stuff that I- that I wanna do. Mm-hmm. I'm like really needing gold for a lot of stuff I didn't want to do actually. So like I'm going to be spending my time um I'm gonna be spending the month of October farming. And then when the Halloween festival comes around, I'll be doing streams where I get every Halloween achievement that gives AP. Mm -hmm. Uh I won't focus on achievements that don't give AP. I'll basically only focus on achievements that give AP. Um and then that'll be and then I'll spend the rest of if depending on how much time is left of course in Halloween at the at the end of that I'll be probably spending the rest of it the rest of my streams doing farming event doing the uh, labyrinth farm mm -hmm. um, and yeah but yeah October will be dedicated to farming streams simply because I just need like so much shit from farming I feel like I need a lot of gold for for a lot of the goals that I have mm-hmm And October is, like, the perfect time to get them, to be honest. For personally, like, the it's, like, the perfect time to get gold right now. Um, because I have, uh... I'm taking the month of October off from work overall. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Motherfucker! Like... God what? damn it. What's going on? I fell. Where? What? Uh... Okay, so I was trying to get the uh, vista where you have to like go up through some s uh, ramps and stuff, and then just use a mount. Just use a bunny. I think it's too high. I don't think there. I was I also was able to get like there with a bunny. Like I had to, I had to maneuver my way, jump on one thing, then thing, then jump on another thing. But overall, I could. But I did was able to get it with the bunny. Okay, I'll try that. Cause like I was over there anyway. I was like, oh, I'll just. I'll just uh do this thing and uh you have to finagle it but you but you have to uh you have to finagle it with the bunny but you can get it with the bunny. All right, I'm going to try going over there. Fuck these Orion ghosts. Invisible wall, please. 
People actually do that in the guild? So I'm... The guild that sets people up, you know, people who convert, who, Shit. uh, people who can... Are you okay? Yeah. I fell again. Oh, Poor Pharaoh. Hit an invisible wall. I was not prepared for it. Oh, dear. Did this guy actually get any, sh any crafters to do that? <laughs> That's an idea. Messaging, adding, adding the craft. Ooh, that's an idea, actually. Someone's at my door. I'll be right back. Okay. I was actually heading over to you so that's I could show you. Do you have the Griffin? Yeah. I'll Time wait for her to get back. Damage. I'll wait for her to get back. But um. So right now, like I'm in a, I'm in a guild. Oh, you can glide from here if you have. <gasps> you can glide from here. Oh my god. Figured it out. Guys, I'm gonna help Farah get this vista. I figured it out. Even if you don't have a even if you don't have a mount, you can still glide. Awesome. Alright. You'll see you'll see on Farah's screen when uh when she gets here. But um anyway, so actually I'm in a, a guild. I said this last episode or episode before last, where we basically hook up people who um I'm currently who, where I basically do uh, conversions, I convert Still, um, tier five material. I tr convert material. I can I, I I work together with other people so that they can make legendaries, and they pay me sixty gold per thing that I do. Um, I don't think I went into much detail about it, but anyway. Um, but some. But I'm actually very new to this, so I don't know exactly how people get hooked up really but somebody just somebody who was in my rank the shiny converter so basically does the same job as me um just uh in discord said hey all crafters basically he added the rank of crafter to uh and he was like um i want to do conversions does anyone does uh, hit me up if you need them so that's something that i'm probably gonna do after we were finished recording after i do some things uh, Cause I have a thousand, I have over oh, almost a thousand one hundred spirit shards at this point. I'll probably get more soon. So like, I kind of, it's kind of time, you know. It's kind of time. Mm -hmm. I'm back. Oh, welcome back. Thank you. But oh, hey, come over to me. I actually, I actually found. You come over to me. Uh, it takes the bunny to get up here, but you could actually. Do you have the griffin? I do. You don't have the griffin, right? I do. I just don't have the beetle yet. Okay, you don't. You have the you have the griffin. Then you can come over here. Use the griffin to get over to that to that thing. Okay. I can see. I can't see the vista from here because it's kind of faded out. But I can see where the vista is supposed to be from here. And I think I can get on the griffin and go over there. So come over to where I am. You kind of need the bunny to jump up here, but then you can. Use I just the teleported griffin. to you. You just teleported to friend. I could have yep. just gone to the vista then and, and you could have teleported <laughs> friend over me. But this is a learning experience. Bam, bam, bam. There's the vista. So I just, I, I just figured that out. I might have gotten it last time and just not thought about it. Oh. No, actually, I think I jumped up like around. Yeah, I jumped up. Basically, I jumped onto in order, to, in order to get myself. I jumped onto the top of this building and then I used the bunny to jump up. Uh, yeah, so I jumped up onto oh. the top of this building. And I I'm gonna jump up over here. That is so smart. Yeah. Meanwhile, I was just being a f the down. scrubbiest of scrubs. Wow. <laughs> also, we could you probably could have gone up that ramp uh, at the temple of Lissa over there. Bunny hopped up on to the thing. I think that's was that what you were saying? There's um. There's I don't know about a ramp. Basically you you go up this ramp over here at the at the temple. You go up here. Um the I would say this is the easiest probably. Mm hmm You basically go up here. This is something I just figured out. You go up here, bunny hop, zoop, 
Griffin over there, or glide. You can technically glide from here. I can see it. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you can be able. To, you're you're able to glide from here too. Yeah. So you just need the bunny and the glider to count to do this. Let's do it this way. Yeah. But yeah, it's pretty cool. Thank you. So anyway, for those who uh, want to do this, uh, who want to do this, have at least the bunny and the glider, or preferably the bunny and the griffin, to make it a little bit easier. Uh, you can do it that way. You mm -hmm. don't have to do it the normal way. Mm -hmm. The normal way is kind of a sh blech. It's not too bad. You just gotta be careful where you're stepping because there's, as as they saw, because I was doing it the old-fashioned way originally, mm -hmm. and they saw me fall right through a damn freaking hole. Yeah, that's the thing. They have holes everywhere. I don't like it. I don't like Yeah, the, I even I had like my camera, way. like, turned down, so I was making sure I wasn't gonna, like, walk off the wrong thing, and I, I was, like, glancing the other way and just being an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> But actually, I just finished out my last, the last of my um, Valor Tree trait line, so mm -hmm. I will have to look at that uh, base Guardian build soon to, not to, to wear the correct gear for it. Yeah, I just opened up the meta battle so I can look for my build, the build, so I can make sure I have the right um, traits and everything. I don't have everything. the Valor traits on because I didn't have Valor trait line maxed out. I just finished, I, I maxed it out. And got access to the dragon hunter and the uh, whole and the firebrand trees. Mm -hmm. But if we hit level eighty, I'll probably end up taking a dragon hunter build. Rather, mm -hmm. I'll probably end up changing up my build to be a dragon hunter build rather than a base guardian build. Uh, because dragon hunter is like currently the meta for guardian power builds, I think. So probably prefer to be a dragon hunter rather than a base guardian. Mm -hmm. If we hit 80, which I'm level 78 at this point, like, I could pro I'm probably gonna make it to 80. We've got, what, one, this episode and the next episode left? Um, I think so. How many Fridays are in October? This is, like, our third episode recording today. Yeah. So we have next episode. I'll probably be 78 at that point, you know? Mm -hmm. Um. I'm definitely not gonna finish Malkor's Leap by the end of the episode. I've got 71% in it. Yeah, because uh, this episode will air on the 19th of October, and then the next one, which will be the last one we need to record, will air on the 26th. Yeah. We have got... We've kind of sped through these episodes. We did. They go like, by so fast. <laughs> yeah, like, well, okay. Usually we spend a shit ton of time behind the scenes talking, but I think because I took a caffeine pill... Right before we started recording, uh, we had a little bit of like going right into it as a thing. Mm -hmm. I also didn't want to, you know, spend too long behind the scenes talking mm -hmm. this this episode. Yeah, I didn't like. Generally, we spend a sh we spend like hours behind the scenes talking, just having conversations. Mm -hmm. Shit. But we didn't really talk about much that like required us to be behind the scenes. Like most of the time, it's like. We, it's private information or, like, you know, stuff that we don't really want in the streams. So we end up, like, talking about it behind the scenes. Mm -hmm. Or, we like, really, plotting like, and planning stuff. Yeah, plotting and planning, too, yeah. But, um... I've been, like, I'm kind of... I'm honestly, like, pretty hype, hyper today. <laughs> like, this is the first day in weeks that I haven't been super, super tired. So I'm really happy that, I'm honestly extremely happy that I took that break from work this morning and just slept. Mm -hmm. <laughs> For those who don't know, I kind of, um, I, I slept all morning this morning. This is, we're currently recording in the afternoon. I slept, uh, from like, I, I think I managed to get to sleep around 11, 11 p.m. last night, which is kind of early for me, to be honest. Like, usually I fall asleep around 12 because of the shit that I go through at night. But, um, like, to, last night I fell asleep around 11 p.m., and then, um, I woke up around 12 p.m. to this, this, to this afternoon, I guess it would be. Mm -hmm. Like, I woke up at, like, 11.30 or 12 this afternoon. So it was, like, really crazy. I got a lot yeah. of sleep, but I still woke up at, like, 8 because I went to bed just hella early. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I mean, like, 
normally I don't sleep very well at night. Like, mm -hmm. I, I sleep fine once I get to sleep, but the problem is getting there. to sleep is yeah. the problem. Um, for me, like, I have some mental shit going on. I get a lot of symptoms of uh, PTSD at night. I get a lot of, like, panic attacks at night as well. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, like, nighttime seems to be, like, the worst time for me to fall asleep, but, like, my family is all, like, daytime people. Mm -hmm. They're not night owls like me. Like, I, I get, like, when I have a schedule where I sleep during the day and work at night, like, I get a shit ton more done than I, than if I were to sleep at night and work during the day, to be honest. But, um, like, I'm a night owl, basically, but my family is not night owls. And they're the ones who have to drive me to appointments and shit. Mm. So I can't get, I can't like find specific appointments, find specific like, you know, things that I can't like go. Once I get my own driver's license, I can probably start taking night jobs, um, having a schedule where I, you know, go to appointments at night mm -hmm. or late evening at least. Mm hmm. Like, I'll have a lot more freedom to, of, around my schedule at that point. Yeah. But for now, like, I can't do shit. So I gotta stay to their schedule, which means having trouble sleeping at night. Having trouble sleeping, get, not getting enough sleep. <laughs> so. Yeah. Yeah, but... Also, like, I had... I had a pretty hectic schedule recently, too, you know? Mm-hmm. Like my, I, I, I said this, I think in an earlier, an earlier recording session, where I stayed up past, like, I, I stayed up, either, it might have been off camera, honestly, but, um, like, I stayed up all night for a stream one day. Like, a few weeks ago, I stayed up all night, and I'm still recovering from that stream, so having that morning where I just slept in, instead of trying to get work done in the morning, was like really helpful honestly it's the first day in weeks that i've been capable of like getting a lot of work done in a short amount of time i'm happy i'm happy i took that break <laughs> but anyway my timer did go off uh it, it did go off at like a little bit of a go okay. i just wanted to finish <laughs> ranting <laughs> <laughs> no no giant don't 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 look at me don't i wish those things counted towards giant slayer i really did they don't they don't. Then why are the giants don't count as giant slayer? Only very, few, very few giants. There are very few like actual giants. To count as giant slayer. Man, okay. <laughs> well, that's disappointing. But that's also all the time we have for today. <laughs> yeah. Um. Oh, this is a champion. That's why it kicked my ass. Okay. Oh, I'm rip. Sad. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell because I'd love to have you here for every video. Give this one a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Videos get uploaded back on my regular upload schedule on Wednesdays and Fridays, so don't forget to check back often. Links to my Twitch, Tumblr, and Twitter will be in the description box below, as well as all of Monica's links. If you still need to download Guild Wars 2 or pick up an expansion pack, I have affiliate links down in the description box for you as well. Thanks for watching, everyone. Have a great rest of your day, and we- oh, fuck that giant. No giant. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> Um, I'll see you all next time for another episode of Vigil Sisters. Bye. Bye. No, Risen Quaggan, everything just leave me alone. <laughs>